Hi everyone. So today I wanted to show you how I do a full service checkout with guests from my virtual parties. Uh, so I want to show you, I created kind of this fake party here um, on Consultants Corner, which hopefully you know how to do that. And I did a little filler order here. And so this is what you're going to see on someone's order whenever they place an order with you. So in order to do a full service checkout, what we want to do is we want to reach out to the guests. We want to make sure that they're happy with everything on their order. We want to see if they need any um, recipes for their products or if they would um, like have any questions or if there's a piece of stoneware on there, I might uh, let them know about our warranty that we have for that and, and things of that nature. So the first thing that you want to pay attention to is here at the top and you can see interested in business, potential booking, future show books. Of course, you're going to want to mark these whenever the situation comes up where they're interested in those options. I automatically send the home office marketing emails to every order that comes in. And this is using your personal website. And what happens when you click this is that they're gonna get emails from your personal website, leading them right back to you. And they do a really nice job with those emails. They're full of recipes, tips, um, really fun things. So make sure everyone's getting that from you. So here I can see that this person has placed an order. And here is what I do when I get that. So on my computer, I have this thing called the snipping tool over here. If you are doing this from your iPad or your iPhone, you could simply do a screenshot. Um, so, but let me show you how it works for mine. So I'm going to do new. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put their information all in this little thing here. And I save that as filler order order. So their name and their order. And I delete it right when I'm done with this. So then I exit out of this or minimize it. And what I'll do then is I'll go to that person in the party and I will find them. You can do that by going here and I'll send them a message. I'll just go ahead and message myself because we can do that. So I'll send them a message and I will send them something that says like, hi, thank you. Thank you so much for ordering. From her party. Here's what I have for your order. So I'll send that and then I will take this photo that I did and I'll send it in here. So she is seeing everything that I am seeing, where it's shipping to, the total, the products that she ordered. And then I'll say something like, um, do you have any questions? Would you like any recipes? And if she does want some recipes, what I'll do is I just go to my personal website. Again, you want to link to her personal website as often as you can and say she wants something for her quick slice. So I might come on here and uh, go here. I click my recipes. And it's going to show some, of course, this, okay. Quick sickle, it auto corrected. So quick slice, right? Okay, let's try that again. Why is it doing this to me? Okay, quick slice. Clearly I picked the wrong thing for this. Okay, here we go. And I'm thinking of a recipe in particular, this might not have been the best example, uh, where it works really well, there's like a crazy salad. Here it is. Okay, this one's the one I was thinking of because this one uses the quick slice. Um, you can see right there. So I will just copy that link and I send it right to her. 
And so what this is doing is it's taking her right back to my website. If she says, you know, oh, great, that looks great. Thank you so much. And I'll say, awesome. Would you like to do a party of your own? Uh, host gets additional rewards for everyone who books from her. And I would love to do the same for you and your friends. What do you think? And of course she's gonna say, I would love to do a party with you. And then you'll kind of get that process started. But that's why I do this. And let me tell you, one of the biggest reasons I like doing things like this I like to start the conversation on Facebook Messenger. When you go to do your customer care calls after they receive their products, it's gonna be really, really nice because they're going to have already had this conversation with you. And the other thing that I like about this is I can go back and see everything. Whereas if I did it on the phone, sometimes it can be hard to remember everyone. So this just makes it really easy. You can do this exact same thing via text message if you feel that that would be better. Um, but that's exactly how I do customer care. Very, very quick, very, very easy. And I can just go ahead and delete this. Um, so I'm not having to use that. And another thing that you can do um, if you feel like people aren't responding is you can put like a photo on here saying thank you for your order and say, you know, please check your messages to go over or just like messages um to go over everything and make sure go over your order. i don't know something like that over your orders everything looks good and then i might post that and then tag everyone in the comments below who has ordered or have my host do that so that's just a really good way to kind of touch uh, touch base with everyone who's ordered, see if they're interested in hosting a party of their own, and also give them awesome customer service so that they appreciate having done business with you. So I hope that was helpful, and uh, let me know if you have any questions about that. Talk to you guys later. Bye!